In this tutorial on iPads, I'm going to show you how to create a collection or a folder so that you can organize apps that are similar into one area. Remember to delete apps, you have to get them all to shimmer. So what we're going to do to create a folder is basically the same kinds of steps. The first thing I have to do is I have to press and hold on one of the apps. Once I do that, you can see that they're all shimmering and in the upper left hand corner there is an X. That's how I would delete the app if I wanted to get rid of it. But if I want to create a folder, I take all the apps that I want to be in that folder and I simply drag one app on top of the other. When I let go, you can see there's a new folder icon that's been created. The two apps that I worked with are together and the iPad puts a title for the folder that it thinks I might want to use. Now I already have a folder called Books, so I'm going to name this something different. The collection of apps that I'm putting together right now is called Stack Books. And there's actually, and what it is, is it's several apps with different books that I can um, read. So in this particular, the two apps we're looking at, Ricky Tiki and Sherlock Holmes, they're from the same company, but they're books. Thus, the reason that the folder had books to start with as a descriptor. Now, I have two more apps that are stack books, and I want to move those in the folder as well. So I simply, they're still shimmering, I simply drag those apps into that folder. Now, if you look very closely at this folder, you can see that it shows four mini app icons. So it does tell me how many apps are in the folder. Each folder can contain up to 20 apps. So folders can be very handy for organizing, if, especially if you get a lot of different apps. Okay, so I've made that folder. Now to work with them or go into one of those apps, I simply tap my home button one time. And that is how you create a folder. 